So I've had a lot of people ask me where Johnny is. Now, if you are a Patreon, you know exactly what's been going on with Johnny. Um, this is some video taken back in September at Stable View. He was just there so I could keep him in work. But you'll see that right um, tube grip that's on the right front. He actually had an injury that occurred in his stall. And this happened when I was at a horse show and he stayed home. So here you can see the uh, laceration or the cut. And this happened, uh, which another freak thing. And here you can see the vet is kind of checking out the flap. Um, and she's actually having to cut the flap off because we weren't able to suture it up. Um, now, what I figured out he was doing it on is uh, the bar on the bottom of the stalls that has, uh, it kind of keeps the shavings in the stalls um, or did whatever in a stall. He smacked his ankle on that bar and that caused that blunt force trauma kind of caused this V shape uh, on the ankle. And so again here, you can see that is cutting off the flap. Uh, because the flap tissue was, wasn't going to reconnect. However, the other com complication with, with this is because it is right over the joint and that is an area that constantly has to move, it can be very slow process to heal these. So we also took an x-ray because again, he kind of smacked his leg pretty hard. That all looked good and he was also on antibiotics. You can kind of see that flap there. Uh, so again, this is really kind of an annoying injury and it took a good while to get it to heal. That cut happened back in July and this is taken in September. So uh, it was healed some, but it was still kind of open-ish. So I had to, um, when I could ride him, he had to wear that sock, which is, the t it's called the tubi grip and that's actually used for humans and casting. Um, so it's very handy to use. I, you'll have seen it also in cross country when he wears his cross country boots because it helps to uh, alleviate boot rubs as well. Uh, so he's feeling great. Uh, again, th this was back in September and I was still dealing with that cut. So he had a pretty quiet season of no competitions and just getting him legging back up and making sure that that cut healed. So looking forward to 2020 and we'll be aiming him to the Kentucky Five Star. Uh, all my vets are very happy with how he's looking and so I'm really excited and now his cut has finally healed and it's looking really good. So yay for Johnny.